Hello friends, happy Vlogmas day four. I am sitting in the living room today instead of in the library where I often sit to film and vlog. But honestly, this is the cleanest room in my house right now. And my Christmas tree is just so pretty. I decided to go ahead and put ornaments on, but instead of using all of my ornaments, I just stuck with white, clear, silver, and a little bit of red here and there. Not very much. And it just is making me really happy. So I'm sitting out here in the living room and I just thought for today's video, I would just keep it real simple and share with you all the things that I'm doing for Advent. I probably should have turned on the overhead light so that you could actually see me a little better. So sorry for the lighting. <laughs> but I have collected <laughs> quite a few different Advent calendar type things all of them, except one, I believe, are only 12-day Advent calendars, 12 days of Christmas, basically. So I am alternating which days I open them. So I do have a few things to open and doors to open. So I have that for you. And also a little look at my Advent devotional that I'll be doing for the next couple of weeks. So I just wanted to share those things with you. I am not going to include opening the Advent things in every single video. I feel like that would get a little tedious, but I will have like compilations to include when I have a vlog. So I will take clips of when I open the things and then include all of that together in a vlog so that you can kind of skip ahead of that if you want to, if it's not of interest to you. But for today, I just wanted to show you the different ones that I have. So I have four two from etsy which i will link down below and then fab fit fun and the jam a jam one that i will link down below as well and also i remembered i have a picture one and then my advent devotional and i think i have a once upon the book club advent calendar coming i need to find out where my tracking number is for that and see where that's at because i feel like i ordered that a while ago and it has not arrived curious. All right, here are all of my Advent things, except I think I have one more coming in the mail. So today is December 3rd, but we'll start with this one. So this has for each day a little picture and you have to guess the book. So obviously day one was Winnie the Pooh. Let's see if I can find day two is right here. Okay, I haven't looked at it yet, but here's day two. Oh, Robin Hood. Looks like Robin Hood to me. Cute. And then day three is this newspaper down here. Um, there's a girl and a dog. Get closer to that. In the mountains, is that Heidi? The mountains make me think it's Heidi. If you guys have a better guess, let me know. But that's day two and day three of that calendar. Okay, I've got everything ready. I had to get this started because this is a really difficult one. So this big, huge one is from FabFitFun. I got an ad on Facebook and I'm a sucker. So I got this one. And I'm going to do the same thing with these two where every other day I will do one and then the other. So I'm going to open one and two for my jams and jellies. I just got it started. And then only day one from FabFitFun. So let's start with the jellies because there's two of them. So this first one is, oops, that's the back. Apricot banana, oh yum. That kind of sounds really good. And the second one is orange guava lime. Oh my word, orange guava lime. I'm gonna have to make some toast in the morning and tell you what those taste like. Put one on each, that's nice. There's a good amount of little, there's a good amount of jam in there. A couple pieces of toast at least. Yum. And then, oops, close that up. From FabFitFun. This is like a lifestyle, beauty, different kinds of things. Oh my word. Let's see what we got for day one. This is water bank blue hyal hyaluronic. I can't say that cleansing foam oh that's good i need a new cleanser soften visibly smooth skin cool i'm gonna use this tonight when i wash my face maybe i'll put a little clip <laughs> 
All right, just two more. So, so this is the first one from this shop, which I will link in the description, the ones that I got this time. I forgot to do that when I unboxed my last book, but this came from India. So we're gonna see what it is. I tried to get it started. A resin resin page holder. Oh, look at that. It's real sparkly. It's kind of blurry, but it's really sparkly. That's what you kind of put in your book. You can hold it with your thumb. Cute. Fun. And then we have the book. I just cut this time. This one is a hardcover. Let's see what it is. Let's squeeze it up here. I'm trying to do it one handed is a little tricky. Oh, a Nicholas Sparks. <laughs> How fun. Two by two. I have not read a Nicholas Sparks book in a really long time. Two by two by Nicholas Sparks. Have you guys read this one? Is it a good one? Do you like it? Do you not like it? I didn't, I don't have anything against Nicholas Sparks. I just haven't read his books in a long time. It's really chunky. I'm not going to look at the description right now, but yeah, let me know if you guys have read Two by Two by Nicholas Sparks. All right, so there it is, today's Advent openings. I'm all caught up now, ready to wash my face and have some toast and jam. Actually, I think I have some shortbread cookies. I might do some of that tonight. And a new book. Fun! One other thing that I am doing for Advent that actually technically starts today on December 3rd is this Advent devotional called Good News, Great Joy. It's kind of shimmery, so it's hard to see that. An Advent study on the power and person of Jesus. So I'm going to go ahead, I think today, oh no, that's the table of contents. Let's see. Day one, right here. Candle lighting, hope, and the memory verse. So I'm going to go ahead and look through all of these introductory things and then that first page. But I just want to show you a couple. Yeah, it's a little brighter. I just want to show you a couple pages in here. So it gives you some suggested study tools, how to use this study, how to study the Bible, different options there, and then an intro, which I will read and the calendar for the month, and then the introduction to the offices of Christ, and then week one, prophet. Jesus is the perfect prophet who fulfills every prophecy and brings us hope. And then I will read this introduction to hope, the first candle of Advent. And there's our memory verse for this week. That light shines in the darkness, and yet the darkness did not overcome it, from John 1, 5. And then tomorrow, I believe, I get started with the actual devotion. But I have a lot of intro introductory stuff to read today. Okay, I'm very shadowy in my kitchen right now, but I just opened up my two little jammy jams. There's quite a bit in here. This was a decent advent calendar. I'm so glad that I bought this one. I, one of my patrons and friends recommended it. They got it for themselves and so I'm like, I'm going to get that too. So this first one I'm going to try is apricot banana and I have these rolls that a friend of mine sent me with, it was like a cup of comfort. I forget the name of the company, but it was like comfort food and she sent me chicken noodle soup and mac and cheese and it came with a bag of rolls and a stack of cookies. Yum. Okay, so this first one is apricot banana. Definitely very banana. <laughs> it feels like baby food. It's very smooth. It's not chunky. It's good. The banana is a little overpowering, but I mean, I would eat that. I would put that on toast. It's delicious. Then we have orange guava lime. And this one is cool. I don't know if you'll be able to see it. There are rinds. Let me see if I can get one. <laughs> there's like rinds orange rind orange peel I'm not sure Ooh, the lime on that mm. <laughs> okay this one's orange guava lime 
Oh, that is nice. It has a tartness to it. Different. Very different. Very citrusy. Oh, I like it. <laughs> Yay. I'm going to like this jam advent calendar a lot. Because now I have all these. Now I have two more little jams to put in the fridge. Sweet. Does anyone else use whiteboard markers on their mirror to keep track of things? I have a to-do list over here and these are thank you notes I need to send. But I am going to go ahead and use my new cleanser. Let's track it out. See how it goes. <laughs> There's something just so nice about having a freshly cleansed face. I'm really not very good at being consistent and <laughs> doing a skincare routine or anything like that, but I do just really love having a freshly clean face. And I'm going to go get some moisturizer and call it a night. Thank you so much for watching. A little bit of a different video today, but this is what I fell up to. And so this is what I did. <laughs> I'll talk to you in another video tomorrow. Bye.